Let's fucking get it. shot in you know you know how we do what's your name my name is andrew what's up andrew and you know we out here what's up y'all i feel like i'm having those um those needle therapy things when you walk into a shop i forgot what, what's it called what's it called what's that like when you do that needle therapy thing acupuncture yeah 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 you know i mean i'm in one of those right that's now that's kind of what you are basically hey that's my bone right there Hey, uh, so you might not see anything right there right now, but like this is this is my uh, first MRI shot. It feels yeah. weird. Hey, what you doing right now? This is the stuff that tells make sure that we're in your soul, make sure that we're in the joint. So first we do. Holy shit! <laughs> that is crazy. Don't move. All right, move. all right, Stay all right. Still. All right. This, if this dripped on you, it's just a little. Oh, it's basically water. How am I doing, Doc? You're doing good. Thank you, man. You're the best. Love you. I appreciate it. Hey. Okay, good. We're in. What he's doing right now, he's putting H2O in my system. And it, it, it'd like detect like what kind of abnormalities I have on my shoulder. Hopefully it all goes well. Um, I'll be waiting for my results maybe like a week or two weeks. It feels weird being here. I'm not gonna lie. But like, I actually enjoy it. It's not as freaky as I thought it'd be. Is that more water? This is the contrast agent that you show up on the MRI. I'm, I'm waiting for him to push the whole thing in. I'm waiting. Do your best, Doc. It's going in. Do it, do it all the way in. That's oh, it. Oh, okay, okay. That, that's my bone right there. Yep, and we're all done. Okay. Now, I know okay. something's up with my shoulder. I tell you, something is up. I don't know if I, if I might get surgery or not get surgery. It all depends. We'll just have to see. All right, pulled up to the hospital. I find out my MRI results today. My doctor is going to talk to me about what the fuck is actually wrong with my shoulder. You can sign my copy down at the bottom for me, please. All right, it's too early for this. <laughs> you feel me? Oh my god, I'm not no, I'm not a morning person, you know. Not nah. oh. la hand dominance. That's my jack off penis because I have AIDS. I'm in the room right now. James, I need to tell you that um, I have a torn labrum and a hill satch lesion, and uh, according to my results, right here, you are fucked, James. What am I doing? I'm so bored. Jared Gentile, yeah. Uh, James, pleasure to meet you, man. Yeah. How are you doing? Good, good, good. good. Hi. <laughs> so, I understand you're having problems with the shoulder or popping out, huh? Yeah. Yeah, I guess it's been over the last couple of years. Started from like uh, 2017, I believe. Just yeah. First time it happened, uh, it all started from breakdancing. Yeah. And then after that, like, things kind of started turning downhill from there. I mean, second time, is I did a flip. <laughs> and it popped back in. Yeah. Cause you know, I'm not trying to pay a thousand dollars for the hospital, right? you know. <laughs> but I know, but it's fine. But yeah. I, I'm good right now. You got it back in. I mean, yeah. it doesn't always, sometimes you have to go somewhere to yeah. get it back in. Yeah. And then the third time is I box somebody and I popped out. Dude, the dude's a fucking pussy. Oh! 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 So yeah, they, the other office kind of got the MRI of your shoulder and, and basically what it showed is that you had a bunch of dislocations in your shoulder. So what happens when the ball pops out of the socket, um, there's, you have something called the labrum, which is the bumper around that socket. Right. So what that does is it's kind of like, kind of like a bumper on a pool table. This makes this shallow socket much deeper. Yeah. So what happens when you're, the, the ball pops out, it basically will hit that bumper, tear that bumper. And actually what will happen is it'll pop out and a lot of times bang against the top part. 
So, bang, yeah, yeah, so what happens, so normally see how that's how very shallow. Yeah. It'll dislocate and bang against the front part of the socket and actually create a bit of a pothole in the back part where it's been popping out. And you definitely have it. This is obviously, this is a bit exaggerated. Oh! Yours, yours isn't. <laughs> Yours isn't quite that big. Oh, really? No, okay. but you definitely have one there. Okay. And that actually makes it easier to pop out when you kind of have that there. But also, so that's one problem. The second problem is because yeah. it's popped out a bunch of times, this labrum here, which is that bumper, is actually torn. Yeah. Okay? You just get a bigger tear. You can actually get bigger potholes each time it pops out. This is the lining of the ligaments. The ligaments get stretched, and they get stretched more and stretched more and stretched more. Right. So it surely gets looser and looser and it's easier to pop out. We're still to the point where we can fix this. And I think we do need to fix this. I mean, you're a young guy. Yeah. We, we got to get this fixed so you don't cause more damage yeah. that's going to say lead to arthritis when you're 40. It ha shit happens, but you know, <laughs> I, I, I know, but hey, I think I'll, I'll be ready for it, you know? I mean, you're a young, healthy guy, but this just takes time to heal. I mean, yeah. you've done some damage to the shoulder. Oh God. Oh God. I can't wait to see my results. Oh my god. So the way MRIs work is we take kind of slices of you in different planes. Yeah. Okay. So this this one here is taking slices of you kind of coming from the top of the shoulder working our way down. Yeah. See how it almost looks like a little bit of a Pac-Man bite right there? Right here. Yeah. Oh, that, so, that... so that's where this is kind of dislocated and banged against the front. Similar to that picture I showed you okay. over there. But it's not as, this is like, it's, it's small. Not, it's not as big, I mean, that's decent, it's decent size. Oh, that's a this, decent size. Well, right here, this is that labrum we're talking about here. Yours is just kind of, kind of gone. So we put anchors into the bone, like here, and get that labrum repaired. And then we'll put an anchor basically right into this, this guy right here. Then there's some capsule there. We basically tie back down in there so that heals. We fill in that pothole there. But your socket looks fine. You haven't oh, done that yet. Oh fuck yeah. Okay. If you, if you don't if you don't do anything for like five years and you dislocate a bunch more, yeah. If you start to wear away the socket, what that, are these that's white things? That pothole is. That's that dye they put in your jo your joint. Remember they put that dye. Yeah in yeah yeah. Before. Okay. Yeah. So that better helps. It kind of puts more contrast in there, so you can you can better see. From the look of it, it doesn't, it doesn't look that bad. I don't know why. I know I know it's bad right now, but like. I'm a shoulder specialist, so this yeah. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Especially yeah. the, like this guy here. So, a guy like you, active guy like you, if you want to stay active and not have further problems, I mean, I don't think we have much of a choice at this point. Yeah, that's fine, this dude. Only yeah, just be careful and uh, try not to do something. Where oh, shit. Out again, yeah, so. You know, I, I, I will, well, I'll try. Okay. I'll try. I, will, I, prom I promise you. I promise you. Okay. I'll work. <laughs> hey, great to meet you. Yeah. Yeah. Too, right, one second. Time you'll be right in, okay? okay? Take your time, yeah. Damn, homie. That shit is cool. Whoop, 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 whoop. It's like a baby forming you know i'm gonna get surgery it's gonna be like later down the road i'm probably expecting definitely before the end of the year and when i do i'm gonna be out of the game gonna be chilling gotta go physical therapy all that type of bullshit yeah that's pretty much it <laughs> good morning guys 5 30 a.m i'm getting surgery for the first time i feel kind of excited for it it's going to be a minimally invasive operation. I, I don't fucking know. I want to get shorter again. I got to get like shoulder surgery. Oh. Yeah. Well. Thanks, man. I just, want, I just want a good shoulder, you know? Yeah. <laughs> I'm sick and tired of having, having it be fucked up all the time. Huh? So I just might as well get it fixed. Did you like hurt her from like sports? Yeah. All right, thank you. Have a good one. Pull it up to the hospital. Let's fucking get it. Oh shit, that's me. That's me. Wow. First come, first serve, huh? Yes, sir. Put you right here. Oh. This is just where they're gonna get you started. They're gonna take you to another oh. area for your surgery. Shoot. Okay. Go take everything off. Make sure you let the nurse know that nobody's here so they can put your belongings in the locker. Okay. One bag for shoes, one bag for clothes. Okay. Slipper socks. Here's oh. your gown. I already tied it and snapped it. That's the back. Oh. All you have to do is slip it over. Okay. Just have a seat on the bed and the nurse will be in. Okay. okay. You got it. Good luck with everything. Thank you. Thank you. Awesome. All right. I switched out of my clothes. All right. Good morning, man. Come oh, on. Uh, uh, hello? Yes, ma'am. Oh, 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 yeah, yeah. Sure, sure thing. It's on backwards. Turn oh, it it is? oh mm -hmm. okay. I had a feeling it was on backwards. Yeah. I told you the opening was in the back. My bad, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> I hope y'all ain't mad at me, though. No, you're fine. I mean, oh, I'm 22. Oh. I'm old. I'm old. You're 23. You turned 22. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I, I'm stupid. Your birthday was yesterday. Thank you. you Thank you, sweetheart. Now put your head in the hole. 
Oh, come on. Tie that. There you go. Oh, oh. Yes, and you have to remove everything. Remove your undies too. Oh, for real? Yes. Okay, okay. That's so crazy. What? I'm naked right now. Okay, you're going to have surgery. <laughs> this is so crazy, Aaron. What's crazy? I'm getting surgery. Like you are. It feels kind of weird, but I'm kind of excited. It is weird, isn't it? Yeah. You're gonna do great. I love your attitude, Aaron. <laughs> don't let don't let no hater talk you down. I I I love it. Well, thanks. Try to be life's too short to be ugly and bitter, right? Dang, Aaron, you're so beautiful. Oh, well, thanks. Of course. Do you think I'm beautiful too? Of course. Oh you are. man, you what a sweetheart. So there you go. Damn. Your little surgical cap. Don't hey. you look? Don't you look cute? Hey, hey. So hey, I'm, cute. I'm, I'm trying so hard not to blush right now. <laughs> <laughs>
So you also had a bit of a pothole in the back part of your ball from all the times it kind of popped out and hit against the back part of the socket. Yeah. What we did is we basically put an anchor into the bone and basically tied the, your capsule, your joint capsule, into that pothole so it's yeah. not there anymore. Okay. How long was this procedure? I know you guys like knocked me out or whatever you call it. It's like, I would say about an hour and a half. Yeah. I mean, because you basically had to almost do two surgeries in one where we kind of did, we had to put kind of put the sutures Thanks, in the man. back to fill the pothole in and kind of had to repair the label in the front. So okay. it probably took about an hour and a half. Okay. So yeah, we had to kind of repair and tighten your shoulder back up. So I don't want you going crazy and doing all this a ton of stuff right away to kind of loosen up what we used to kind of tight, tighten your shoulder up, you know? Oh, okay, right, yeah. right. But yeah. the whole point of the sutures is to hold your tissues in the correct spot so they heal back to where they're supposed to be. Wow, yeah, that's so yeah. crazy. Like four dislocations later. I mean, sometimes people have one dislocation, things can kind of heal up, but you had four of them. So yeah. it wasn't going to get better without doing this. That is true. So, yeah. Thanks so, for doing this, man. Yeah, so I mean, we still got a ways to go in terms of your recovery and rehab, but let's get you set up with a good therapist. Yeah. Um, somewhere kind of convenient to you. And uh, I want to see you back in about four weeks. And at that point, we can get you out of the sling and, and start to do it a little bit more. Okay, yeah, that's cool. Okay. Yeah. All right, man. All right, man. Thank you. Hey, again. See you in about four yes, weeks, sir. okay? All right, man. Go ahead and uh, get your shirt on and we'll get you checked out, okay? All right, yeah. Dude, she really said I gotta be in a sling for another four weeks. Oh, this is killing me, bro. I hate being on a sling. I hate sleeping on a sling. Like, it's so uncomfortable. I just finished up my bullshit. Just put on my shirt. I'm ready to check the fuck out. Be in my sling for another month. And start physical therapy next week. High key excited. Really want to get my shoulder working again. Thanks for uh, keeping up with this journey. Anyways, I come back here October 7th on a Monday. So, yeah. All right, wait, wait, wait. As far for the October session goes, I didn't really record that because I didn't bring in my camera that day. But it's basically the same thing what had happened last month. But anyways, back to the video. <laughs> When it's hot, turned to the city, I broke off the notch. Got some more millions, I keep me a knot. I created history, it made me a lot. He tried to diss me and any no fox. We call them trusted, cause they gonna chop. Took off. <laughs> It's good. You can move if you want. No, this is your stuff. You raise it up. Up there, good. Uh -huh. Fucking tie here uh -huh. for me. Turn out like this. Good. How about reach behind you? Good. Any issues, concerns nah, at all? No, nah, everything's chill. I got, good? Yeah, I got one more session. Therapy session. Okay, good. good. So it feels stable? Yeah, it is. Yeah. I, yeah. I feel like I have a shoulder again, honestly. Yeah. Another thing about the shoulder is it's all about everything kind of being in balance. And yours, everything was just kind of stretched out. Cause it kind of popped out and stretched. So like that's like what my before yeah. treatment was. Yeah, 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 yeah. So when we were in there, we tightened everything up. Also, kind of repaired that bumper around the socket. Mm -hmm. So now everything. Obviously, we had you. We almost made you too tight initially because we knew as you did therapy, you were gonna stretch back out to what is considered normal. Oh, where you're at now. Oh, okay, so okay. You look great. So uh, I think yeah, it's just being, being smart about getting back into activities and lifting and working out. I mean, I'm going to clear you out. I think you're good. Okay. So, I'm happy to see you in a couple months, but I think as good as you are now. Oh, no, awesome. You're, you're awesome. good to go. So, awesome, man. Awesome. Okay. Anyways, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Doctor said I was good. I'm good, man. It ain't my fault. Two hundred and thirty-four in almost two minutes. Oh, jeez. So how so how do you feel? I feel like a baby, bro. <laughs> Look at this. Alrighty, I just finished physical therapy. I graduated. All thanks to this guy right here. Hey, man. Great work. If you need anything? Let me know. I will, man. Oh, I feel like I have a shoulder again. So this guy's the best. You're Thank welcome, you, buddy. Man. Yep. Alright, good luck. Alright man, until next time. Yep. Thank you. So these past two or three months has been 
kind of unreal. A lot of ups and downs throughout all this. And uh, I'm glad I, I got the surgery that I needed for my shoulder because if I didn't, I felt like it would have been bad in the long run. So I figured, hey, might as well get the surgery now. So I did. I want to thank every single one of you that took the time to watch this whole documentary unfold about my journey, uh, what I had to go through after shoulder surgery. So, but if you guys like the video, give it a like, comment, thumbs up. Bye. I'm the doctor now, bitch. What's up?